In this video, we're going to apply the remainder estimation theorem, otherwise known as the Lagrange error bound, to find a bound on the error associated with using the sixth degree Taylor polynomial centered at x equals zero to approximate the function cosine of x on the interval negative three-fourths to three-fourths. Now, according to the theorem, we need to identify a value of m such that it is the maximum value of the seventh derivative of cosine of x on the interval of interest. Now, the seventh derivative of f is sine of x. So let's take a look at the graph of sine of x on the interval negative three-fourths to three-fourths. We see that the graph is strictly increasing on that interval. So the maximum value of the absolute value of the seventh derivative of cosine of x on the interval negative three-fourths to three-fourths is sine of three-fourths, which is less than 0.682. So in the theorem, let's let m equal 0.682. So according to the theorem, we have the error bound is bounded above by 0.682 divided by 7 factorial times x minus 0 to the 7th. This 0 is because that's the value we generated the Taylor polynomial about. So the sixth degree Taylor polynomial approximation of cosine of x centered about x equals zero on the interval from negative three-fourths to three-fourths has an error of at most 0.682 over seven factorial times three-fourths minus zero to the seventh, which is less than 0 0.0000181. 0, 0, 0, and this is quite good.